Welcome to the Kia Kitchen. I'm Ron Doran, and today we're going to make one of my favorites, a Greek omelet. Uh, this week I'm driving Kia's newest vehicle, the Seltos. Seltos in Greek means son of Hercules. So uh, in honor of this Greek word, we will make a Greek omelet. And we've got all the ingredients here. Onions, both uh, uh, sweet onion and red onion, green peppers, tomatoes, spinach, Kalamata olives, feta cheese, and egg whites. You could salt, pepper, some avocado oil, and we're good to go. In the oven, so we have some roasted potatoes, sweet potatoes, and uh, some small yellow potatoes with some fresh rosemary from my little garden upstairs, and thyme, salt, and pepper. Uh, again, in avocado oil, they love it. And the first thing you gotta do is put a little bit of avocado oil. And what we're gonna do is saute the onions. Because they take the longest to cook. You can go ahead and put a little bit of salt for now and add a little bit more later. We can go ahead and add our peppers. About a handful for this smaller one. And we're gonna have two handfuls for this bigger one. We're gonna add the spinach last because when you add it, it really shrinks up. Add a little pepper at this point. Cook nicely. I'm gonna go ahead and start adding some more ingredients. Next, we're gonna add the tomatoes. So add these one by one. Spinach over here. We're having the spinach first because it doesn't need a lot of time to cook. Now we're gonna add our egg whites. We have about six egg whites here. Add the olives. And this one gets the feta cheese, spread it around. Just a touch of salt. Some more pepper. A lot, of good, a lot of good veggies in here. All right, so there you have it. We have our roasted potatoes, a little bit of onions, and some rosemary from the garden. Here we have our two Greek egg white omelets, one with feta, one without. Doesn't take that long to make it's all in the prep work. Use fresh ingredients. Well, that's a wrap for this episode of the Kia Kitchen. Hope to see you guys soon. Farewell from San Clemente.